What's up guys, it's Captain Ross here, East Town Aquatics, and I am here with an unboxing from Chewy.com. Now, big shout out to Chewy for having some of the best prices this Cyber Monday. Absolutely awesome, and just to let you know, it is Wednesday. I don't know when this video gets out, but it is Wednesday right now, and I am already in possession of these, and I ordered them Monday night, so, and it was free shipping. So, go check out Chewy.com. They're great. I called them up to ask some questions about their sales. Excellent service, 24-hour service. Call them up. Definitely recommend them. Fort Wayne Fish Tanks likes, likes them as, as well. Amazing deals. Some of the, the best deals as far as aquarium products and dog and cat and all the other pets that us aquarium people have as well. I'm sure a lot of us have dogs and cats. But anyway, that's besides the point. Beside the point, let's get into this unboxing. I'm going to show you what I am getting or what I have got. I've also made a huge order from uh, Doctors Foster and Smith, an order from Amazon, and an order from MarineandReef.com. Uh, if that MarineandReef.com doesn't trigger anything, uh, this will. I am going to be starting a reef. Yes, the scrub aquarium kid that has never done anything even close to difficult besides angelfish if you just if you even count that as difficult is going to be starting a reef yep um, I've been told by a lot of different people it's not that hard if you pay attention and you do your best and just follow the rules and do your research and I've definitely been doing my research and I made a huge purchase this is just the first part of it so let's dive right on in see what we got going here so first the first thing you can see are these quiet flow 75s now these babies twenty two dollars I kid you not twenty two bucks so I had to go out go ahead and pick me up two I don't even need two I just decided to get two I need one might use one on the reef load it with chemical filtration and mechanical so yeah I haven't heard, I heard these new versions aren't as reliable, that might be why they're cheaper. The LED Pro, they're like the new version. Um, I know they've gotten a lot cheaper, so they might be cheaper in a sense that might not be as good, but we'll figure that out. $22, who's going to pass that up? Got myself a marina breeding box. Um, I may use this as a refugium. Um, I also got a phoenix refugium um, with the water pump so I'll probably use that because it'll have more flow but as far as right now this will probably be for breeding so yeah I'm gonna use it with my mosquito fish but yeah it's great this is thirteen dollars right here we got the coral life bio cube protein skimmer twenty four ninety five right here um, I heard this is the best one for nanos I'm gonna throw this in, probably in, yeah, we'll see, in a refugium or in the, it's really small. So we'll throw it in. You see how small it is? Look at that. Probably won't fit in the refugium actually, but this thing, for how small it is, it's gotten really good reviews. It's probably gonna work very well. So we'll get that set up later on. And I'll have videos on my reefing stuff too. And then lastly, this is kind of upsetting to me since you know I've been working with cobalt and stuff um, I feel like I kind of betrayed him in this but I decided hey it was cheap and it has a different feature that I needed I got I hooked myself up with a maxi jet I know I'd rather have the cobalt MJ but for now what I needed was this part the uh, circulation pump part and it was cheap, it was like $12. So since I was spending about 300, over $300 on stuff, I've, and more once I get live rock, I figured, hey, I'm gonna pick this up. If this one doesn't work, I can always get a different one. It's like, if I get a $13 pump and it's not what I need for the saltwater tank, I won't mind getting something else. But if it's a really like expensive one, I'll, wouldn't want to switch it out if it somehow didn't work for me. So I'm going to try this. Um, we'll see if Cobalt decides to send me one to review. Then I'll just like 
sell this off or throw it in something else. But we'll see. I decided to try it. Uh, I think it'll it should work okay. I'm sorry, Cobalt. I, it was cheap. But yeah, um, I would love to review the uh, MJ because I'm sure it's a better product. I'm sure it is. But I'll let you guys know what I think of this thing because. I've heard a lot of good things about Cobalt, and I know it's more expensive, so it's probably a lot better. We'll see. I'll let you guys know. And I'll, hopefully, I'll get one from them, from them, and I can do a comparison for you guys, and then you can really see. Anyway, MaxiJet 900, I'm going to be using this part, just so I can get some circulation in the tank. And that is all I got in this box, but there will be more. This is just from Chewy.com. Like I said, Doctors Foster and Smith coming in. We got Marine and Reef. We got tons of stuff coming in. Amazon. So, quick look at the tanks. Let's get these guys fed for you. So, I'm going to do a reef. I think I'm going to do it in this tank, actually, and move the guppies to a pond in the summer. And then we'll see what happens after the summer. I might just sell them off. So, we'll see what happens there. And then, yeah, we'll see what... Uh, what becomes of this tank and what I end up doing for the reef. Um, if you guys think a 20 gallon would be better just so I can like keep this thing up and running, let me know. I'm gonna be using this light here. It's a Coralite Aqualite double T5 fixture. I have, a cur I have just one in here. I've already ordered lights. I'm getting one 10,000 K and one uh, actinic blue. So that should be good. And I'm also getting, I have these mini fixtures here. These things, little nine inches, and I'm going to be putting in um, a 10,000K mini T5 in them and putting it on the uh, Refugium, my Phoenix one. I'm going to build a hood for it and everything. So that'll be cool. Uh, I'm so glad I can finally trash these things, these old breeder boxes, and go with my Marina one because they're the Marina one's going to beat them by so much. But, yeah, I think that's enough rambling for me. Here's a look at the 55. We'll get them fed for you. Um, I'm using cobalt food right now. I'm going to have a review coming out soon. But it's good stuff, for sure. Fish love it. I learned with pellets, you kind of want to do them gradually because you don't want them all to get trapped on the ground. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks, Thank you so much for tuning into my videos and giving me good support. I promise you, I know I keep saying it again and again, contest, contest. I'm going to have one eventually. It's just school's been a pain in the butt for me, and I've been just uh, struggling through it. So we'll get through it, and we're going to come out of this. I'm going to come out of this hopefully as a great with a great channel. Uh, let me know what you guys thought of my last video. It was a uh, close-ups of the Phoenix, not Phoenix, of the Fluval Spec. I might do some more videos like that, the close-ups with the music and stuff. My buddies over at uh, United Gamers GB make great music. Check them out. They made music for this one, and they actually edited it, edited the video for free. So it's awesome. I've worked with them on music making before. So, oh my goodness, enough rambling. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.